Uh, I'm here behind the bar with Alice Ivy, and to celebrate your new song, Get Me A Drink, you're gonna get me a drink. How does that sound? I'm excited. I don't think any of us know what we're doing, so <laughs> it should, should be all right. I hope it's okay. Sorry, the bartender will just be with you in a second. We're gonna start with something really simple and actually non-alcoholic. Now, do you know what's in a spider? It's two scoops of ice cream. But with the song, Get Me A Drink, I mean, obviously, the lyrics are sort of written by your collaborators in that song, which is like East and Charlie Threads. Did you, do you have like a narrative or anything in mind when you send the instrumental? It was just like, oh, you know, like I wanted to be a feel good vibe. And from then on, we kind of worked out that we wanted the song to be about when you're out. And then like someone comes in that you don't want to see and you're just like, oh, oh no, what do I do? Like, fuck, oh, yeah. I'm just gonna go, I'm just gonna, you know, go get a drink and just not care. I've never played with one of these before. <laughs> Do you want to try it out? Do you want to try it first? I, I kind of do actually. Okay. I'm, I'm a little bit hungry. Have you had a, a healthy breakfast today? I actually haven't had breakfast today. Well, that's a good starting point. Uh, Delicious. I'd rate that spider pretty well. Obviously, the spider is a bit of a, a baby drink. It's a child's drink. We're going to get a bit more adult here. Have you ever had the drink known as a Jaeger bomb? My heritage is German. I am Jaeger. <laughs> so you, you are Jaeger. Do you want to pour a shot of the Jaeger? Mate, I don't know how this thing works. Look at that. It's broken. Ah, uh, there you go. Uh. You just gotta take it off. Alright, now. Oh, that's not a full shot. Free energy, an up and coming energy drink. So if you wanna pour that into the uh, the big glass there. It's been a while. Okay. So I dropped the whole glass into this. Yeah, yeah, let's just drop it in there. Three, two, one. Oh. The youth. Have you ever heard of a cosmopolitan? I have, I yeah. have. And is that from Sex in the City? I don't know actually. <laughs> now the first thing is we need to get some crushed ice into this martini glass. We just need to crush it. Why are we trying cr <laughs> Obviously we're amateurs, don't try this at home. Ooh, I've actually squished it into the bottom now. This is what you pay a bartender for. Okay. How do you cope with uh, the drinking lifestyle on tour? I broke my leg at Paradise. Yeah. I had a beer in my hand and I was like ready to go. And I walked down to the stage, finally had my tent set up, finally had everything ready to go and I was ready to have a good time and I slipped on a black safety mat and I broke my leg and I got amboed out of Paradise Music Festival and then I had my leg operated on the next day. Oh my so, God. So bad. We need uh, two shots of vodka poured into this glass there. I can't wait to try this out, just like the Sex and the City girls. Now we need uh, two shots of this Contro. Just one shot. One shot? Oh, just one shot? One shot, yeah. So I, I'm, I'm getting overexcited with this recipe here. About half a cup of cranberry juice, and let's squeeze uh, half of a lime. I often think sometimes your music sounds like being drunk. <laughs> yeah, I guess like, I just want people to have a good time. All right, we're having some trouble. Uh, I think we're stuck here forever. I got it, I got it, I got it. Woo. Put the strainer on here. Fantastic. And that is a Cosmopolitan. Yum. It's pretty good. Uh, well, thank you for getting me a drink then today. Do you feel like you've learned something today? I feel the like I want to have Jägermeister on my radar. Well, best of luck on the rest of your tours. Thank you for sharing your knowledge with me. It's been cool. <laughs>